Hi there guys, this is another commonly asked question in the series JC12's FAQ, Frequently Asked Questions. In this video I'm just going to be talking about having no power to the servos of your RC receiver and your RC servos of your nitro or maybe electric RC vehicle. The first thing to check if you've no power to the servos, I'm going to say the obvious, is to make sure that you have turned on the radio first and the receiver next. Especially with 2.4 gigahertz radios, if you turn on the receiver first and the radio after, sometimes they do not bind correctly or they do not bind at all. Always turn on the transmitter first and last off. So you should turn on the radio first, then the receiver. When turning off, turn the receiver off, then the radio. If you've checked that and everything is working, next thing to check is the batteries in the receiver compartment. There should be four AA batteries. I always recommend rechargeables. And also in the transmitter, there should also be eight AA batteries. I also recommend rechargeable ones or very, very good quality ones. Do not use cheap batteries that are likely to drain very, very easily. Always use expensive or decent quality batteries or rechargeable ones. If you checked all of that and all of the batteries are working fine and all the power to everything is good, next what you need to do is remove the receiver housing and check that all the receiver connectors plugged into the receiver are plugged in correctly. Make sure that they are all plugged in the right way round. If you have recently installed new things then it is very very possible that something has been put back incorrectly. You should check that the battery connectors are the right way round and the positive and the negatives are all correctly installed in there and that both of the servo connectors are into the right channels of the receiver and that they are both plugged in the right way round and plugged in firmly. If all of that is okay then it is a possibility that your on off switch has gone bad. Try replacing the on off switch. If the on off switch is all good then there is only one last thing that it could possibly be and that is is that you may need to replace your servo. Um, often the servos can strip, often they can die, maybe it is time to replace your servo, perhaps it got water damaged etc etc. Time to replace your servo and then perhaps all will be good. A good way to test it actually is to interchange the servos. Plug the steering one into the throttle channel, plug the throttle channel into the steering one. That will show you whether it is a servo problem itself or perhaps a problem with the receiver or maybe even the transmitter. Once you have checked these points, if all else fails, please look in your manual or perhaps contact me, jt 12 rchelp airworldcouk and we can go through some diagnostic procedures. Thank you very much for watching and more videos are coming soon. YouTube.com forward slash J2012. See you soon guys. Bye bye.